It's Saturday night and live on 2K Sports. We've got the excitement of the NBA for you tonight. This is Kevin Harlan along with Greg Anthony and Brett Berry. David Aldridge will be reporting from the sidelines. It's the Miami Heat taking on the Boston Celtics. So the opening lineup for the Heat, they've got Dwayne Wade. Shane Battier is out there with LeBron James. Then there's Chris Bosh. And it's Chalmers in at the point. Here's Boston now. Here's Posey. Outside Rondo. Six on the shot clock. Nobody near Allen. Traps in the tray. Allen's got the first bucket of the game with the three for Boston. And it's Wade with the ball for Miami. It's a three-point game. Bosch, a screen on Allen. Wade passes to Bosch. Maddie trying to break loose, and Bosch gets it to go on the assist by Wade. What more does Dwayne Wade have to do to impress you? Still one of the smartest players and passers off the pick and roll game. On offense, here are the Celtics. Passes it to Allen. He dishes it to Posey. Pass to Rondo. Garnett with the screen for Rondo. He feeds it to Garnett. And that passion that Garnett plays with is really infectious. He's always talking and trying to get himself and his guys going. Well, Celtic shooting their first free throws here for the night. Shooting two. Free throw good from Kevin Garnett. And both free throws good from Garnett. Just around a minute and a half into the first quarter. And the pass to Wade. Over Allen. And the basket by Wade. And the mid-range jump shot is something Dwayne Wade has really perfected throughout his career. Rondo with the ball. For the key, Garnett dishes it to Posey. Five on the clock. Rondo passes to Garnett. Miami grabs the miss. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is not right up on it. Now one against Wade. Pass to Posey. Now Rondo, he kicks it to Poe. No good that time. Nice D from Bosch. James finds Wade. Now here's Bosch over Rondo, buries it down low. And Bosch knew he was going into the teeth of the defense, still finds a way to get it done. Boston Trail. With a short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin, I was able to talk with Doc Rivers a few minutes ago. He told me it's always a challenge when you face a team this opportunistic. He said those guys are going to look to take advantage of any weakness. We have to really communicate defensively tonight. Guys, back to you. 
All right, David, thank you for the report. One of the tougher things to accomplish, Greg, slowing down great shooters. Yeah, you have to cover the entire floor defensively. That's going to take a terrific commitment on their part. Well, there's been enough time for them to dig into a lot of video in this one, so they should be ready to go. Really heads up there, a play where you locate the best open pass, and then you get it there for an easy bucket. And now, the first time out called here for Boston. in for the Celtics. Kendrick Perkins, he's checked in for Poe. Davis comes in for Kevin Garnett. Allen's checked in for James Posey. And it's Cassell in for Rajon Rondo. And then for Miami, Miller comes in for Shane Battier. And it's Allen in for Dwayne Wade. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. Allen outside. Here's the teardrop. And no good that time. And here's Miller. He'll bring it up for the Heat. Kicks it to James. Here's the floater. And he sinks the layup. Confidence and LeBron James go together. Knows when to float the jumper off. That time, great touch. Celtics trail by three. Pass to Allen. Shoot. Have to play in the first quarter. Pass to Cassell. Over Chalmers. Misses off the right iron. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that. Left side, Bosch. Teardrop shot, and that's two points on the layup. Bosch has got eight points. Well, he hasn't missed yet, guys, and the defense is scrambling for answers to stop this hot start. And that outstanding drive and finish brought to you by Mobile One. And putting that pressure on the rim, that's what it's all about, threatening with that attack. Gazelle against Chalmers. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. First, and a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the Heat. Right away, they showed us they weren't going to shy away from the mid-range game. And it's proving to be an effective tool for them. So much good energy and flow tonight. And it has really come out of great ball movement. Guys have been open, and as soon as they are, they get the ball. The first one falls. Anderson, he's checked in for Miami. Lewis comes in for James. Good on both. At this point, you might as well go ahead and chalk up the points when he's at the free throw line. Pretty much automatic. There's the pass to Allen. Out to the right wing. 
Gazelle against Chalmers. Stolen. Here's Cassell, right side Davis. Over Lewis, pass to Cassell. 46 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Just five on the clock. He kicks to Perkins. Over Chalmers, it's tipped. Passes it to Allen. On the wing, Miller. Good ball movement here by Miami. Chalmers against Cassell. Chalmers' shot is no good. Celtics trail by three. Here's Cassell. That one doesn't drop. What a performance for Chris Bosch. He has been the story for the Miami Heat. He notched eight points in the quarter and has that terrific basketball instinct on display. And we'll be right back after this. It's been a pretty even game here after one quarter of play. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from Miami, guys. Well, their effort on the defensive end has set the tone for this game. That defense has been infectious here as everybody stepping up aggressively on that end. Here's the Celtics with the ball. They trail by three. Garnett out there with James Posey. That's Rajon Rondo. Then there's Allen. And it's Poe in at the center. That's the five to begin the second quarter for the Celtics. Shot clock at six. Here's Garnett. Score the basket. Nice shot after missing his first attempt. Just a knockdown shooter. Garnett so good with the ball in his hand. James the pass to Wade. That one, no good. Excellent tee there from Allen. Miller against Rondo. Pass to Garnett. Over Wade. That one, wide left. And here are the Heat now. LeBron outside. The pass to Wade. Back to James, and the call will be against Kevin Garnett. That's his first foul. Chris Bosh is checked in for Miami. First team foul. In for the Heat, Chris Bosh. Here in the second quarter with a little over a minute gone. Pass to Miller. He kicks it to LeBron. Clock at four. Three-pointer. Wade gets the three-pointer to fall. Wade's got his second basket of the night. And we know Dwayne does not take many shots from the outside, but he really knows how to pick his spots. Garnett with a screen on Miller. Garnett up top. Fades. Again, Garnett missing. And I was sure that was money on that one, but everyone is afforded an easy miss or two. Yeah, that happens. Important thing is for players, just don't beat yourself up and make a miss like that cost you another play. Celtics trail by four. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. And Posey kicks to run. Passes it to Posey. Garnett with a screen on LeBron. Over Battier. And there's the call on James. That is his first foul of the game. DJ Brown's checked in for the Celtics. First team foul. Coming on to the floor for the Celtics. DJ Brown. Now here's Rondo. Allen outside. Shot clock at five. Now the dish to Garnett. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. It's going to be on Shane Batty. 
and just a great all-around scorer. Garnett has the defense a, a little anxious there. On the night, he's gone two for two at the stripe. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one drops. Both free throws good from Garnett. And a little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the second quarter. Miller kicks to Battier. To the paint. The shot's good on the assist by Wade. Wade's got three assists now in this one. It's terrific basketball from Wade there to thread the pass to the wide open man for the clean look. Now here's Rondo. Pass to Brock. And here is Posey. The pass to Rondo. Now here's Allen. Shoots the three. And it's LeBron James with the rebound. Miami leading by four. He dishes it to Buck. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Tony Allen. That's his first foul. Allen's checked in for the Celtics. Gazelle comes in for Rajon Rondo. The Heat also changing it up. Lewis checked in for Batty. Allen comes in for LeBron. And it's Chalmers in for Mike Miller. Garnett against Lewis. Heat moving the ball around. Four on the shot clock. Allen passes to Chalmers. Jacks up a three. A shot that time, not on target. And Boston will go the other way with it. It's stolen by Allen. And uh, almost four minutes gone here in the second quarter of play. Outside Bosch. Back to Chalmers. Pass to Bosch. Just four to shoot. Allen for the three. The rebound by the Celtics. And here is Allen. Passes to Cassell. Here's Garnett. And yes, it's good. Eight points for Garnett. And when Garnett gets it that deep, the D is at his mercy. How about the extension when he's able to get up on that low block? Now here's Wade. He's got five. And again, it's the Heat missing. You know, the right thing there to try to fade away with the D all over him, but that is a difficult shot to sink. And it's slammed in by Garnett. And you can see him give a little nod and then just burst to the rim for the alley-oop slam. A pair of teammates, Greg, with a terrific feel for each other. Here's Wade following the score by Kevin Garnett. Wade kicks to Allen. Again, the miss by the Heat. Allen outside. From deep three-point range, they get a bet. Garnett, and he makes that one. Garnett's got 12 points in the game. He reads shot trajectories so well. Garnett understands how to capitalize on that offensive glass. They get a hand on it. Wade against Allen. Wade passes to Chalmers. Bosch, the screen. Five to shoot. Going inside. Looks for Lewis, gets it to him. Over Garnett. Deflected by Garnett. And some changes here for the Celtics. Kendrick Perkins has checked in for Brown. Davis is subbed in for Kevin Garnett. Heat also with a sub. Anderson's checked in. Austin with the ball. They've only allowed five points in the quarter. Allen for the three. The rebound by Anderson. Miami trailing. Five-second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. 
Bosch sets the pick for Chalmers. Off target with his three. Chalmers against Cassell. Allen for three. The shot's good. Cassell making the play. Cassell's got three assists now in this one. And this is Allen's game. One of the quickest releases we've ever seen. Amazing shooting off that pass. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. It's the Celtics ending the second quarter with a 13-5 run. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. Hey, everybody. Shaq, do you know what time it is? Nope. It's time to check out the early season NBA power rankings. Take a look here now at Boston. They've been playing well since we last ran the rankings. What do you think, Ernie? Have you been impressed with them? Well, they've won three out of their last four. Not too shabby, if you ask me. And you did. And let's get into this first half, where there were some struggles for the Heat. They've worked the ball inside. Keep feeding your big dogs down low. Roof, roof, roof. Good things will happen. Spoken like a guy who made a career out of living in that paint. And that is a wrap. Now let's send you back to Kevin Harlan for the start of the third quarter. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. It's been a clinic from Kevin Garnett. Yeah, and early on, he has been feasting in the paint, and, and you have to think they're going to keep feeding the big fella. Oh, man, pouring it on right now, and why wouldn't you? Here's who Eric Spolster is starting the second half. They've got Chalmers. LeBron James is out there with Shane Battier. Then there's Chris Bosh, and it's Wade in at the shooting guard. And you don't ever want to get into the habit of letting the offense get to the rim. The Celtics have been excellent at the free throw line here today. A flawless six for six. And he makes the first. That one is no good. The Heat trail by six. And here we go. Fast break. Wade's got it. The kick out to Bosch. Fires the three. Poe grabs the miss. Poe's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Posey with it. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. Over to the left wing. Just five to shoot. Here's Garnett. Pass to Posey. Fires from deep. They get it again. And another shot. And the layup is good. Pose got the lead up to eight now for the Celtics. Yes, but they won drops after the 0 of 3 start. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Bosch sets the pick for LeBron. And Bosch gets it to go on the assist by James. James has got three assists now in this one. Celtics leading by six. Ondo on top, defended by Chalmers. Garnett with a screen on Bosch. Tipped away. Out of bounds, Miami takes possession. Allen's checked in for James Posey. And Miami with a change here, too. Mike Miller's checked in for Mario Chalmers. Over a minute and a half into the third quarter of action. 
And Miami calls their first time out of the game. And coaches looking to seize every advantage, maximize every possession. Got to feel good as a coach if you make all those adjustments. Pull the right strings. That's what they love to do. Bosch dishes the Battier. Miller outside. Now the pass to James. Good work there as it goes. LeBron's got his second basket of the game. That's just good basketball. I think King James down low is not a bad option. And we're just around two minutes into the final half of play now. Rondo looking over the floor. Shot left block, and the shot is good. You can't just stop when there's a pick set up. Got to fight over it as a defender. That's one that the coaches will watch tomorrow with that player. You hate to see him give up in that situation. Here's LeBron after Rajon Rondo's bucket. Miller finds Bosch. Six to shoot. Here's James, Addy trying to break loose, and they call the foul, so he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. The Heat shooting their first free throw of the game right now. Austin making a switch here. Brown's checked in. Chris Anderson has checked in for Miami. What's up? Free throw good, LeBron. And LeBron James, for all the things that he does on the floor in terms of his skill set, there's a quality of leadership that becomes the X factor and gives teams confidence that they're going to have a chance to win an NBA title. Now here's Rondo. Pass to Allen. He can't hit that time. And it's Miami the other way. This shot's just, it's not there right now. With this team leading, perhaps, you know, let's focus on some other areas of the game. Here's Anderson. And again, it's the Heat missing. And, and got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. Allen kicks to run. Over Anderson. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That's on Chris Anderson. Uh, and although he's a bit smaller, Rondo knows he's got to outthink guys on the interior. And that time, drew the contact. This is his first trip to the line tonight.
And that one falls for Rondo. Yeah, when Rondo gets motivated, and we've seen that now for a good stretch, he's as valuable as it gets. Perkins is checked in for Leon Poe. The Heat also changing it up. Lewis checked in for Batty. And Allen subbed in for LeBron. And good on the second, so he makes them both. And here are the Heat now. It's a five-point game. Wade passes to Lewis. A little under two and a half minutes off the clock now here in the third. And the basket by Wade. Wade's got his third bucket of the night. Are you surprised that Dwayne Wade is going to score that far in the paint? I'm not. Oh, what an impressive dribble drive. That replay brought to you by Mobile One. They had a nice score that came from just attacking the rim. Huge play in this hotly contested game. Allen finds Rondo. Brown sends a screen for Rondo. No good that time. Wade with the defensive effort. The Heat trail by three. And it's Miller in the corner. And it's out of bounds. The Heat able to retain possession here. Great energy on the deflection and a good job disrupting their offense. Yeah, appreciate the work right now on the defensive end. Davis has checked in for Boston. Cazal comes in for Rajon Rondo. Boston on D. Wade passes to Anderson. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. No question, he got bumped on that shot. Miami shooting their second and third two shots at the line right here. Taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for him. Ajan Rondo is checked in for the Celtics. Heat also with a sub. Chalmers is checked in. So he picks up just one from the line that time. The Celtics with the lead. We've got 148 left here in the third quarter. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. That's on Chris Anderson. And Rondo playing with great energy right now, putting the defense in some very difficult spots. He'll take his third and fourth free throw shots of the game right here. And he knocks down the first one. Both shots good from the strike. A minute 42 left to play here in the third. Miller outside. Passes it to Lewis. Three-pointer. Good. And Miller gets the assist. And this is why Lewis takes so many of those threes. Because of his ability to knock them down. It's a close game here in Boston. Now Rondo. He's got eight. Perkins with a screen on Chalmers. Here's Rondo. And it's going to be a goaltending call here, so they'll count the bucket. Just barely too late, and, and catches it on the way down. He's already in the air there, committed, so can't fault him for going for the block. James Posey's checked in for the Celtics. There's 117 left in the third. And Chalmers kicks to Lewis. Pass to Allen. It's Miller on the wing. Posey covering, and there's the pass to Lewis. 
Miller outside. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Chalmers. Another shot. Cut it, and the Celtic lead has been cut down to just one on the bucket from Anderson. They are just killing them on the interior. Rondo finds Davis. Here's Allen. Here's Posey. Drills the three-pointer. He's going to punish you if you leave him open. He's more than willing to take the open three when he's got it. 41 seconds left in the third. Allen outside. It's Miller on the wing. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. The Heat shooting their fourth and fifth shots at the foul line in the game. for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That free throw good from Miller. Chris Bosch has checked in for Chris Anderson. hits both and here's Rondo he's got 10 it's a four second differential between the shot clock and game clock pass to Davis played in with a nice touch off the glass and the Celtics lead by four and after really leaning on that three point shot in the first half seeming like they're uh, just getting away from it here in the second. More of the shots coming from the interior. Allen for three. And that would have counted, but his uh, shot was off the mark this time. And we've watched three so far in this one. Celtics lead by four. And time for the short break and stay right where you are. The fourth quarter is coming up next. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist of the game. They're just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? Yeah, those are the kind of plays that you want to put on a canvas. Just beautiful basketball. Well, what a terrific game it's been so far with this fourth quarter. Sure to bring more pressure-packed basketball. We've got James Posey. Allen is out there with Rajon Rondo. And it's Garnett. And it's Poe in at the center position. That's the Boston Five. Allen with it. He's picked up by James. Here's Rondo. Sweet little floater. 12 points for Rajon Rondo. Yeah, kind of fun to watch Rondo not have the hot hand with the pass, but with the shot. Here's James. Passes it to Chalmers. Kicks it to Wade. Bosch a screen on Allen. Here's Wade. And Boston with the rebound. And that's the battle they haven't been winning today. Their work on the glass has been porous, and that's got to change. Pass to Garnett. Over Bosch. Offensive rebound. Great positioning on the putback. Garnett's got the lead up to eight now for the Celtics. And when Garnett has it going, he's unguardable. I love how confident and versatile he is on offense. James finds Wade. The second chance effort. Here's Bosch. And it's sent back by Allen. A pass to Posey. That's it go. There's Allen. That's good on the assist by Posey. And it's a 10-point Boston lead. And a closer look here at the hustle stance for the Celtics. 
Uh, they've been active defensively, rotating well, and, and then also closing out on shots. It's resulted in a number of blocks. The other part about tonight, you got to give credit to the coaching staff. They came in here with a great game plan, defensively locked in. They were ready for the sets. They jumped in passing lanes. They came away with steals. I mean, they anticipated just about everything. And it's Rondo with the ball for Boston. Boston. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. Timeout called the Celtics. got some time to check in from the sidelines. What you got for us, D.A.? Well, during the break, I listened in on Doc Rivers talking to the team. He told them, this is a game of runs. It's a game of momentum. We may have the lead now, but I'm telling you guys, it can evaporate in a hurry. Let's close this thing out. Kevin? Thanks, David. Second minute off the clock now in the fourth. He kicks it to Posey. Pass to Allen. Now here's Rondo. Just five to shoot. Poe inside. Working on Bosch. The shot's good from Poe. Not everything fell for them in that first half, and now it looks like they're beginning to hit their stride. Just a little under two and a half minutes have passed now here in the fourth. It's stolen by Allen. Pass to Rondo. Back to Allen. And there's the call on Bosch. That is his first foul of the game. And it seems the play-in tournament is here to stay, Brent. Has it worked out as well as you expected? I think it's been great, Kevin. Uh, one of the things that could be adjusted, though, is maybe if you're the eighth seed and you have a 10-game lead on the 10th seed, uh, there should be no reason why they should be competing in the postseason tournament. So maybe they do something with regards to the records as to whether or not a team qualifies. But the way it stands now, it's created the kind of drama and competition that the league has craved. Now, here's Wade. James looking around. Bosch that's the pick for James. And he drives in, and another basket for Miami. James on the attack, and that is absolutely terrifying. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've got about three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. Pass to Poe, to the inside. From eight, Raj trying to free himself up. And Garnett gets it to go on the assist by Poe. And uh, kind of par for the course here, right? Coming through with a solid offensive game to help them get this lead. The Heat trail by 10. Here's Wade. The rebound by the Celtics. 
Allen's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. And there's the pass to Post. Three pointers off the mark. Well, even though he misses that one, the defense has got to talk about that. And that's a bad miscue. And you can't give up looks like that all game long. Now, here's Wade. Pass to James. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. It's on Kevin Garnett. And such a physical player inside. LeBron doesn't fear contact on the way up. LeBron James, two shots. Shoot two. on the first and that brings them within single digits. The Heat making a switch here. Allen's checked in. And both free throws good for LeBron. There's 138 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Rondo against Chalmers. Kicks it out to him. No good from outside. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. Now here's James. Posey covering. LeBron dishes to Bunch. Pocket six. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. And with Bosch, he's got so many tools he can beat you with. So adept at the mid-range shot, and he feels right at home at the free throw line. The line for two. Shoot two. He drops the first one, and that narrows the gap to seven. Throws good from Bosch. The lead's not looking as comfortable after those free throws. Nice job. 58 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Feeds it to Garnett. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three point play chance here for him. Now they're playing working to perfection there if that was their plan. And if it wasn't, maybe that should be their plan. Personal foul. Second team foul. At the line, please, Kevin Garnett at the line, shooting one. And that one misses. And they recover it. Ray Allen is on the wing, defended by Allen. Chalmers' shot is no good. Here's Posey. He's guarded by Battier. Rondo, good. Making every effort to put this game on ice. Loved it. The guys are staying aggressive late in this ball game, just not wanting to let go of the rope. And here are the Heat, trailing by 10. James up top, Posey covering. James outside. Passes it to Chalmers. Six to shoot. The Heat need to get a shot off. Let's it go with a three. Rebound, Boston. Now here's Allen. 
And so it's Boston easily grabbing this one. Some good moments throughout this one, but they have the clear advantage down the stretch. Yeah, I mean, I, I love the way they executed on both ends of the floor, completely under control for the vast majority of the game. And whenever there was a misstep, they just didn't allow it to fester. And that's why they're going to walk away with the win. And that'll do it, folks. So for David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, Brent Berry, and the whole 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for being with us. As New Balance presents our player of the game, Kevin Garnett.